on YouTube, it's been a while, mostly because I never have any idea what to post on here, but I am off to a really exciting event with the Southampton Bloggers, and I thought I would take you all along and kind of show you a few tasty cocktails, because we're off to Cabana for a lovely little cocktail masterclass, so I'll show you when we get there. So I didn't really want to vlog anything and it was quite dark as well um, so I was a bit tired so I kind of went to bed but I thought I'd tell you all about it and all about the food as well um, so Cabana is a Brazilian restaurant they've got a lot of authenticity there which I really like um, you kind of felt it didn't feel too commercial when you were sat in there it felt quite authentic with like the decor and stuff which I think is really nice um, with regards to the food though so I had the halloumi for starters. I was going to go for the cheesy dough balls because they're, they're gluten free, which is amazing. Like who does gluten free dough balls? Um, but they are, and they looked really good, but I just kind of wanted something a bit lighter. So I went for the halloumi and you know, you can't go wrong with halloumi. Um, the mains, I had the super salad and I had it with additional prawns. The prawns tasted great, but they were stuck on the skewer. So I couldn't actually get them off very easily, so I had to like chew my way, like chew them off the skewer, which was a bit annoying, um, because it kind of took away from the flavour, um, so that was a bit, a bit annoying. Um, and then the salad itself was a bit nothingy, like it had iceberg lettuce, a few slices of mango, it just wasn't very impressive, there was no dressing on it either, um, so I added um, some of their seasonings and some of their oils and stuff, which was, you know, it made it quite nice, but... I just I don't think it's really something that I think if you're going to go there for a healthier option kind of look up look at like their grills or something um because their grills looked amazing quite a few people had their grills I had the vegan curry as well was meant to be amazing and the cauliflower wrap um are both meant to be really good options and for dessert for dessert there was a chocolate cake that was gluten free I've never had a gluten-free chocolate cake because, well, I'm new to the whole gluten-free thing anyway. Um, but it was really good. It was quite dense, but they said it would be, so that didn't surprise me. And yeah, it was really, really good. And then finally, we of course had a few cocktails because what is a meal without cocktails? Um, whenever I try out cocktails somewhere, I always tend to go for a Long Island iced tea just because I think everywhere does it differently. But it, it's always interesting to see who, how they do it. I wasn't very impressed with Cabana's Long Island iced tea, I'll be honest. It kind of, it's tasted really watered down, whereas obviously I normally order them because, you know, all the alcohol in them. <laughs> um, but yeah, it tasted a bit watered down, which was a bit annoying. And it wasn't as spectacular as some of the other cocktails. So for my second one, I went for a Jungle Fever, and it came with gummy worms. Yeah. Um, and that was really cool and yeah that just tasted really sweet so yeah that's it from me for today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you like seeing restaurant reviews and if you're interested in seeing more then let me know in the comment section below um drop me a thumbs up as well because that's always quite nice and subscribe to my channel if you're interested in seeing my content a lot more but yeah i'm sure i'll be back on here soon thanks very much for watching bye